Greetings from Salt Lake City. Uh, I'm Jack Thompson. I'm the sales director for Caterpillar, and we are doing our first virtual Scrapbook Expo show. Uh, we're excited about it, although we are sad that we can't uh, be there with you all in person. That's one of the, the, the benefits of, of working for Caterpillar is going to all the shows and meeting all the uh, people in person, and, and we are uh, very sad, as I'm sure you are, that uh, we're not there talking in, in person. Uh, so let's uh, tell you a little bit about us. We've been in business since 2010. We've been making um, crafting tools since then. Uh, and we started with one, our paper trimmer, and, and we have about 15 products now. So that's a lot to get through, so let's get started. Um, let's talk about the trimmers first. Uh, this is called the Cutter Pillar uh, Paper Trimmer. We have two different models. I'll start with the Pro. Uh, this is something that If you haven't seen it, I'm sure if you've been to the shows, you've seen us there. Uh, we wanted to reinvent the way people cut. Uh, and we, we did that doing some pretty unique things. Um, first of all, we changed the way the blade moves through paper. You can see here, especially if we look through this way, you see the blade turns on a gear. Uh, as I move it here, and it really changes the nature of the way the blade moves through paper. This is pretty thick cardstock here. Um, with just one finger, you can see how intuitive it is because that blade turns on the gear and, and it takes that muscle energy and turns it into spinning energy. Uh, and you can see here, I want to show you one of the things it does. It's one of the most accurate trimmers out there. When I mean accurate, there's not many trimmers out there that can cut this. You can see here, uh, you can cut a 72nd of an inch off. Uh, and here's why you can do that. Because this blade is a hard steel, but this blade, the round blade, is, is, a, is a regular steel. So as the softer steel comes across the harder steel, it actually maintains the integrity of the blade. I bet we've had this kicking around the office for two or three years and using it, uh, and it cuts like a brand new one because every time you use it, you maintain the integrity of the blade um, and you never have to replace the blade. And we have uh, thousands and thousands of satisfied customers uh, who have used the same blade for years. Um, we can replace the blade if it does get damaged, um, for uh, just the cost of shipping uh, to send that out to you. So let's say, what, what can I do with this? Well, it can cut just about anything you throw at it. It cuts thick, it cuts thin, it cuts this, uh, you could call this the ready board, the foam board. You can see here, it cuts light chipboard. Um, try that with your your trimmer you have at home. Um, it cuts vellum. I couldn't find any vellum, but it cuts, it actually cuts tissue. Now that is incredible. Try cutting tissue with your static blade and it'll just rip it up. Um, because that blade is always sharp and, and self-maintains, you never have to replace it. That's how you can cut things. Um, it is the most accurate cutter out there. A good way to test your trimmer is just to cut some strips. You cut both directions, by the way. And you pull those strips out and you put them together. And that's how you know if your trimmer is accurate or not. You can test that right now. So this is the Pro model. It's our big one. It goes from 13 to 12 and a half. Uh, has a drawer here that fits your standard scrapbooking paper. Um, you can close it, it locks shut. It's great for like a project. You can just slide your project in, come back to it. Um, now here's the icing on the cake. This, if you haven't seen this, this is the big reveal moment, is your light. Your light shines through the paper. So if I wanted to cut right along these circles, 
let's say at the very bottom, not quite on the line, but on the bottom of the circles here. Now, if I didn't have that light, I would just be guessing. And you can imagine how many times it would take me to get that right. But with the light, I just pull that down to the end. I get a perfect cut every time. Crop marks, uh, pictures, you can make perfect borders on pictures. The light runs on standard AA batteries, which will go for a year, uh, depending on how often you use them, but they will last forever. These LEDs are 10,000 hour LEDs. Great. Um, it has a quarter inch and a half inch grid. It has um, the, the marks down to um, uh, 16th of an inch and it has the marks on here. Also has a metric ruler. So then we have, that's the Caterpillar Pro. This is a Caterpillar Crop. It's the same exact cutting mechanism, same exact everything, but we made it in a little bit more portable version. The arms comes out to 18 inches here. Uh, same light, same cutting mechanism. Cuts wonderfully. And, and it's just a little more portable. Um, very safe. You can actually leave your husbands alone with this and they won't hurt themselves. Kids is, is pretty safe to use. One of the safest cutters out there. Um, so that's our trimmers. Um, everything's on sale 20% off today. The prices should be there for you to see. When we realized how much uh, the light helped people, we went on to make another product. This is called the Caterpillar Glow. This are uh, crafting light boards, illuminated craft mats is what we call them. These are the thinnest, lightest boards on the market. Um, there's nothing thinner and lighter out there. And these are great for um, tracing. They have three levels of light, just working with any medium. Um, it'll shine through your back, through your uh, paper for pages. Now what we did was quite unusual. The light board is great on its own. We developed the first translucent cutting mat. It has a non-slip texture here, so once it's on here, it stays very nice and tight. Uh, then you can show, it shows through, it's a little hard to see through the camera, through your paper to make sure your embellishments uh, on your cards and your pages are all straight. Uh, it's just great so there's never any shadows over um, your work. If you are working with it, no matter how bright your light is, if you have a shadow over your work, you can never see. This eliminates the shadows. You can cut on here just like you do any other cutting mat. That's what's great about here. And it comes standard with the mat. Uh, we have three different models, three different light levels, low, medium, high. The, the, the uh, video won't show how bright it really gets in the, in the middle of a day in a, with a big window office like this. Um, but we have three different models. This is the basic. Um, this is a price point, under, way under $100 uh, before the discount. Um, this is our first model. Now this one, get rid of this real quick, is our, we call it premium. And it's the same exact size and features, but you can see no cord. Uh, you get about four hours of cordless use out of this. Same three levels of light, which really opens up a lot of opportunity for working in different places. Um, they all come standard with the cutting mat, like I said. We have a few accessories. The most popular ones for our crafters is the glass mat. The glass mat is, is tempered glass. We call it the mixed media mat. This is such a great mat because it's, it's the same glass they use on stovetops. It's impervious to heat, to glue, to paint, to Mod Podge, um, ink, stamps. So anything that you want to save your countertop or uh, the light board or anything you're working on, um, and it's, it's impervious to all that. And very inexpensive too. One of our most popular add-ons here. You can put your stuff under here. Uh, if you get the light board, you got to get the glass mat because that exponentially opens up the possibility. This is called the Caterpillar Premium. Now we have the big boy. This is called 
the Caterpillar Ultra, Glow Ultra. You can see it's twice as big and twice as bright. Now the mat I have on here is one of the accessories. I grabbed the wrong mat. It has no lines. So all of our, all of our Glow light boards have um, the standard grid mat, but they also have a mat that has no lines, which really is great for tracing and doing things. You can put it under here, under your mat. Uh, and things like that, and it really uh, opens up without the grid. So it comes standard with a grid, but you can um, add the gridless mat for not much extra. What's great about this, you can actually be working at the same time, having your uh, cut, doing your cutting here and doing anything else, your mixed media here at the same time, three levels of light. It's almost too bright. Uh, it doesn't show in this video, but it's great. If you're in low light, you can come down here to level one, level two, and then level three. That's called the Ultra. Now, all of our items have totes, which are great. This is the tote for the, for the crop. It's all padded. You just pop it in here, strap it, seat belt it in, as I like to say, so it won't fall out. And you just zip it up. Uh, it's, it's padded nylon with a nice logo here that's been uh, sewn in. It has a strap to put on your uh, totes, on the thing your totes. It has a shoulder strap here to add that. We have one for the crop. We have one for the pro. We have one for the glow. So this is a little different. This is neoprene. And the glow goes right in here. And has all metal hardware. Zips up nice and tight. Uh, extra, extra pocket here for your for your cords and stuff. And, and again, it has the the uh, tote strap here. You can just put it right on your suitcase or your tote handle. Uh, and of course the shoulder strap there. And then this is our newest tote, which is for the Ultra. This we really went out of our way to make right. It has reinforced corners, nice hard rubber feet. It's all nylon padded. Uh, it has a full extra pocket here, shoulder straps. Now this is our newest item. Came out last year. We're pretty happy with this one. This is called the Caterpillar Crease. And we wanted to do the same thing for uh, scoring the paper as we did for cutting, is figure out a better way to do it. Now, what's unique about this, I'm gonna show you what not to do. This is a, a scoring uh, tool that everybody has. And we'll show you what happens when, what you're used to doing. So if you score with this, by the way, this is a hundred pound cardstock, uh, which is really difficult to score because it cracks and breaks. So this is a typical scoring. It's super easy. You can see here that you over, I've overscored it and it makes the ugliest. I've, I've, I've actually, I did that a little hard admittedly, but. If I do it again, not so hard. It still leaves this ugly edge. We all have experienced that, especially the thicker, more fibrous paper. Well, we have figured out a new way to score. It's actually two ways. You can come in here and score with the stylus here, which everybody has done, and it makes, this is for quick scores, and it's much, you can see already, it's a much nicer score than before, and I'm folding it both ways to show you. Um, so much nicer, even if I fold it the wrong way. Uh, that's great, making boxes, things like that, but we wanted to figure out ways to score this thick paper without risk. You know, cardstock, if you're making a card, is expensive. Um, so this is called the scoring rule. You bring this out, decide where you want to cut it. This or score it. This is a little scoring channel. 
red tick here. And you just make sure you're nice and in the grooves there. And you put it into the grooves where you want. And you can score either direction if you want. Now that is a beautiful score. I don't care how hard you push or how thick the paper is, you are gonna get a perfect score every single time. Nice and square. You can fold it either direction. Um, this will change your card making and your scores like no other tool out there. And you can score both ways. That's called the Caterpillar Crease. Now here's the bonus about the crease. We made it translucent. Has nice soft rubber feet here. We made it translucent so it goes as a great accessory for our glow products because it shines through the, 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 the positive lines are colored but the negative lines are translucent. So you can see, it's a little hard to see in this light, right through, you can, you, you can start scoring in the, middle of, in the middle of your page if you had reasons to do that, making boxes and things like that. Great way to use the crease on top of the glow. All right, I think that's it. Uh, I hope uh, we will all see you soon. Uh, please let us know if you have any questions um, about, I may have missed a few things, which I've never done this before um, on video. Uh, if we have any questions, uh, let us know through, uh, you can call us or you can uh, type through the, the um, Facebook peripheral there. Um, and we uh, ship out of Salt Lake City and um, we'll sh we ship the same day, so the orders will go out the same day. And we hope to see you very soon at the shows. Jack from Salt Lake City, Caterpillar. Take care.